set of eight slides that we're trying to learn <laughs> that Jill plays um, for the set dancing. So this one's old favourite and it's in G. So some of you already know it. I don't know who does, I does. Maybe John does, I'm not sure. Nobody else does. I think some of us are familiar with it. Okay. I don't know it. You know. Okay, I'll play it to you anyway. It's one of those tunes where you can put in as kind of as many twiddles as you like. You'll see what I mean when we when we start learning it. major octave it's just kind of remembering what you're doing in it it's all around the arpeggio and the good twiddles okay starts on a B we're in G major again and actually some people call this a jig uh, rather than a slide um, in fact that's what it says on the session but that's not necessarily right Jill thinks it's a slide so it probably is it's one of those debatable tunes okay starts on a B It's all around the D major arpeggio. I'll send you the dots afterwards, Hattie. Ending on a G at the end. A couple of little lead up notes to the D. So I'm holding on that D, but you can do a D E D twiddle if you like. Or you could do. Okay, 
Katie, sorry to interrupt. Is it in six eight or four four? When you played it, it sounded like six eight, but now it's yeah. sounding like four square. Yeah, it's in six eight. Yeah, well, it's it's really a slide. Yeah, it's really in twelve eight, but it's yeah. it's in six eight. Okay. No, right. I mean, what I mean is in triple time rather than duple yeah, time. I think when we speed it up, mm -hmm. it'll sound. It's because yeah. I'm on that D. You could do a little triple triplet, little quavers in that D instead. I'll play it differently. Oh, bye, Marion. Okay, right from the start on a B. because the next two repeat again the same as what we've already done so play it right from the start this is where it goes different think of that as all on a Saturday night. That's one on the D. Right from the start. see little leading notes to get me back to the B. to the B section if you're ready. Okay, into the B section. Taking you up to the top G, I'm going to do the two the two other notes of the G major arpeggio to get up there, the B and the D. Okay, those, that B and that D are just little leading notes. Okay, from the top G. Two leading notes to the B section, starting on the B. Up 
duy trì thị ấy cho nên là tạo có That's so confusing. So those two bars together. The first time it's D B, and the second time it's B B. Top G. Once again, and then we'll go on because it repeats itself. repeated the top G bit and then we've got a slightly different ending. section around a couple of times then we'll go back to the A. Starting on a top G. section starting on the B if you remember it
want it a little bit faster? Or should we do, we can do, we can do a couple of other slides to lead into it if you like. The order, I think if we start with Road to Lisbon Varna, and then um, Nello Sullivan's and then Old Favourite, and we'll do them, all, do them all the same speed. And if you can't keep up, don't worry. Okay, Road to Lisbon Varna in E minor, followed by Nello Sullivan's in D, and then Old Favourite in G. Starting on the low E. Mm -hmm. 